as the title said, how to manifest a Android in five days. And because I'm an honest influencer, I will definitely be leaving my huge tip to actually make this method work for you at the end of this video. So basically, this method called 555. So as the name suggests, you would affirm yourself 55 times in a course of five days. But the thing with this method is that if you missed one day of those five, you would have to do the whole thing again. And according to my research, they're saying that you actually need to affirm yourself each day of those five days at the same time by the same affirmation and you need to have it written down like you need to physically write it down i feel like it's better than the other methods that i used like it was easy one two i enjoyed it because it needs literally zero to no effort from you like you could literally affirm yourself in five minutes or less even so i switched to this mirror because i'm blind without my glasses i can't see and i have a fan right here a tiny cute little fan hopefully this won't disturb the audio so now back to the methods basically what i want you to do is you choose the best time that you think it will be suitable to whatever you want to manifest and when it comes to the affirmation, do what suits you. Literally, you don't need me telling you what you want to manifest or the actual words, you know, like, what do you want to say? It's up to you. But for me, when it comes to manifestation, I prefer X thing or X person is X something. I will be telling you exactly what I did and exactly how I used this method in the second part of this video. Yeah, so basically, let's say you're going for a yandere, okay? So, you go, this person is my yandere. Or if you're not going for a yandere, you would go like, this person is my friend, this person is my soulmate, this person is yada yada yada, you know? You'd basically apply it to whatever you're going for. And again, 55 times on course of 5 days. The point of those numbers is just to keep you on track, to keep you having that in your head that you're going for yandere, okay? So, as I said before in a lot of my yandere videos, that you need to keep yourself surrounded by your result without actually being obsessed with it so that's the whole point of the 55 times okay so how i used this method to manifest two yandere's basically i started <coughs> the same day i published this video so i offered myself each night around 10 to 12 p.m. because it was like the best time for me okay i talked about this before i prefer affirming myself whether the second i wake up or before going to bed so i would say x person their name are obsessed literally just those two words their name are obsessed that's it so i am friends with those people on social media and this first person that I'm telling you about, we literally never talked, like never, and I don't even remember when I added them on social media. I truly don't remember. We start talking each day of those five days, and they seemed like a nice person. And I legitly don't know. I forgot to put contour here. It's on you. You distracted me. Well, actually, I'm distracted of Luna here. Luna, say hi. <laughs> she knows that I will be filming today, so she insisted on saying hi to you. If you are curious how this bitch got here, yesterday I went to get some groceries, okay? 
and I went in the morning, which I wouldn't usually do because I'm a night owl, but I went there, okay, and for some reason, it was very, very, very hot that day. I got, like, sunburn, but not really. I was wearing sunblock, but I don't know what it is, just, like, appeared here, and I'm feeling like another one will be here by tomorrow. You know when you get that feeling that a pimple will be on your face? This is not a vampire or anything, but I really don't know what it is. I just my skin reacts very badly to sun. Whenever I stumble across like a vampire thing or like someone mentioning vampires, I can't remember <laughs> Nick when he was like in court and there is a text that he said in it. Well, I'm a 500 years old vampire. If you don't know who he is, I already made a video about him. Go and check it out. Somewhere here, okay? Okay, back to my story because I got a track for no reason. We started talking. That's our first day. I told you I replied back to the texts that I didn't know why I didn't receive in the first place. Like, it was in my DMs, but I didn't get notified, you get me? So I told them, hey, I'm sorry. I didn't see the text and whatever. And from that on, we got to know each other and we talked and talked and talked a lot. So it went nice the first three days of me affirming and me talking to the dude. We talked daily. Yeah. I'm nothing younger about this guy up till now. Well, <laughs> at day three, we were talking about our future, you know, like, what do you want to do with your life? Like, normal talk, you know? I was like, bruh? Like, you tell me, how likely are you to joke about kidnapping somebody? And we were talking normally, we weren't, like, laughing or anything. Okay, I might be thinking, like, no, that's fine, you could, like, joke about it or whatever. Like, come on, okay, no one would joke about that, trust me. Because that's weird. No one would actually go their way to joke about something illegal. Yeah, so that's the first person. The second person? Oh my god. This one was on Facebook. I'm old school. I use Facebook. Yeah, tease me as long as you want. So we texted in there. He initiated the combo. And... Oh my god, that was so weird because, like, listen, I don't date, okay? Not just because I'm Muslim. It's just me. I don't believe in relationships, okay? I don't. I'm a loner, and I'm happy with it. And I found peace in me being alone, okay? I love this life. Are you, like, the type of person to, like, die for somebody? Because I used to be that person. Oh my god, I like... Imagine my yandere, like the one that I manifested, seeing this video. <laughs> and I'll be like, oh my god, no bitch is coming manifesting other yandere's. <laughs> oh my god, like, the combo was so weird. Listen, I don't mind it. If that's your thing, do you. But some things that are left unsaid. And you don't go up to people saying, oh, be my this and be my that because have some self-respect okay now you're asking um, what's yandere about this this is a yandere this is a whole yandere traits and yandere personality if you don't know. okay i look so red <coughs> <coughs> I need to make this work. I need to make this work. I don't know. I need to do something about this makeup. But I'm really enjoying my time. Like, I'm not focusing on the makeup. I'm focusing on this video. Because I really want to do a nice content for you. Okay? I want you to enjoy. But also, I want you to be, like, entertained. And I want you to come off this video with something valid. You know? And you better subscribe. Okay? And hit the like. I'm manifesting a yandere right now. Update me in the comments. Leave me 
what stage are you in? Are you in the friend zone? Are you more? Do you see them a lot or not really? Do you have some weird things from them which you're not supposed to be having? Like those people I talked about in this video? Go and check it out. It's weird. It's awkward. If you don't know what is this about, it's basically just a trend of people from our community. <clears throat> yonder fans slash yonder is themselves. They're going after their crushes and they're just taking pictures without their knowledge. Which is very weird, very creepy, and illegal, and I'm not promoting that. Please do not do this. Okay, please don't. So listen, I've been scrolling through my comments. One of y'all besties said that they used this method before and they got burned out. So I digged in to give you some tips for that. If you're interested, of course. Don't stress about your results. Just don't. I found this the best way ever to manifest whatever you're trying to manifest. Don't stress about it. What's yours will find you. No need to rock your brain. The lip looks so weird. Listen, while editing this video, you'll definitely see it before this one. It's an ASMR reaction. I enjoyed making that video so I think much. And while editing, I was looking at my lips. They looked so weird. Like, I like overlining them, but I feel like they look weird. Like, extra omega weird. So if you have any tips for that, please leave them in the comments below, please. Do as I said, and just surround yourself unconsciously with your results. Mentally, you will feel better because just when you keep on insisting on that result, you wouldn't find it. Let me give you an example. Today, I was searching for a pencil cap to one of my aligners, okay? And I had to do a whole deep clean for my room to find it, like... Deep clean as in moving furniture, and I broke my bag. You know when I found it in the same drawer. So my point is, when the thing is in front of you every day, and you don't think about it, you wouldn't notice it. But the second you want it and you start chasing it, you wouldn't find it. Am I making sense here? Let me just spray the sand again. Oh my god, I'm smelling chemical. This is not sponsored, by the way, for any of the makeup. Okay, the look is done, and I had to redo this whole thing, because I stained it here. If you're a hijabi, you do your makeup, then you wear this hijab. And, uh, yeah, what would you think about the look? It's cute. Do try this tutorial, it's easy and uh, I took a lot of time to do it because I'm filming. If you're not filming, it will probably be done <laughs> in 10 minutes, 15 at most. For the outro, my biggest, huge, humongous tip for you is to give yourself a fucking time. Nothing will come in a snap. Because I've seen a lot of people in my comment going like, Oh, it took me five, seven-ish years, took me this, took me that, to shut the fuck up. <laughs> Nothing won't come easily, okay? Especially like this, like a yandere, a mentally unstable person. And I would say, even if you did try this method, the 555 five, five method, you need to put in that work. Like, yes, I manifested those two, but... I didn't do anything 